Wow! Press start. Dan here and welcome back It's a crazy craft where today I think it is time so wait what did we do last time well we made this thing a hoverboard and I think they are absolutely epic but I probably should not ride it inside to be honest because it's going to be absolutely crazy now why did we make this hoverboard well we need it to try and take down the one and only mobzilla which we tried to spawn in last time and I think we fixed the issue so we're gonna try that out today and I've only just realized we've got 101 levels that is absolutely insane now we've got some golden apples we've got a mobzilla spawn egg we've got the rainbow and we've got some random other spawn eggs as well we've got Cecil just in case and we have ourselves the queen scale armor too and I think we're pretty much ready to go. What do you guys think, huh? Yeah, I think we're ready to go as well. So um, let's head outside and... Oh, I forgot about you. <laughs> you absolutely crazy man with your giant, giant sword. You are nuts. Oh, Treos, I forgot about Treos. Oh, and I forgot to put my horse armor in there. Have I got any on me? Oh, Treos, really? Really, you're going to do this? You're going to do this right? Oh, wait a second. Dan. Sorry, I ate too much sushi and I have been sick for weeks. I think the toilet might be clogged. Doc, Dr. T. Um, what? <laughs> Treoris, that, that is, that is disgusting. Stop. Treoris, listen to me. What is going on here? Why? <laughs> what? Oh, wait a second. Wait a second. There's something going on here. Okay, let's, um, let's get rid of this toilet for just two seconds. Don't worry. If you could just, oh, there's squids here as well. What is going on here? <laughs> What is actually going on? Okay, so um, let's think about this for a second. Let's um, open this. Just... No, no, hold it. Hold it in because I need to get rid of the toilet just for now. And oh, oh, I see what's going on here. Okay, okay, there's stink bugs. There's stink bugs everywhere. And there's a stinky. Am I going to have to kill this stinky? I kind of don't want to, but I think I'm going to have to. It's going to be, it's going to be pretty upsetting for everyone. Oh no, and I've let in some water. Great, stop. Stop it. Stop it right now. Get out of here, stinky. Oh, no. They've made me all nauseous with their stink. Get out of here. <laughs> Get out of here. Finally, we solved Treoris' fart problem. Thank goodness. Get out of here. What is that that um, they're dropping? I have no idea. I kind of I kind of don't want to know right now. Just get that out of here. Get that out of here. And beetle, um, robot laser drop, peach pit. I don't want that either. Oh, my goodness. This is, this is, this is something I was not expecting to do today. Let's be honest here. Wait, what? Why is he- why is he still farting? Why is he still farting? Is he still got a poorly stomach? I have no idea what's going on here. There should be- there should be nothing here. Look. There's- Where is that coming from? <laughs> Where is that coming from? That was hor- oh jeez. Okay, this is horrendous. I have no idea what's going on here. This should not be happening right now. What is happening? This is dead stink bug. Can I use those for anything? I can make a poison sword and kraken repellent. Oh, that's kind of cool, actually. That's actually really cool. Right, um, I need to transform into a firefly. I thought this would have solved it. It turns out he just wants to, he still wants to fart like crazy. Um, let's get out of here. Let's push you away. There we go. I can't believe, where, what is, why is he still farting? I have no idea what's going on. I'm so confused. But, um, you know what, Treyarus? I don't have enough time. Uh, get yourself cleaned up. Yes, all right. Pl flush it. There we go. Um, I can't fart. And I'm trying to. I'm trying to. And I still can't. You know what, Treyarus? Just, um, deal with your own poorly stomach for a second. Actually, is it gone? Has he stopped? I think he might have stopped. He stopped. Yes, finally. We solved Treyarus's fart problem. I'm still listening out for it. I'm still listening out. So, what we're going to do today is try and defeat Mobzilla now that we have solved Treoris' awful, awful fart problem. Now, what can we put away for a little bit? I don't think we need these apples. We've got these apples. Uranium nuggets we can put in here. No, we can't. We've got too many. Not really too bad to have too many of those. What was that noise? I don't like this. There's so many different noises in Crazy Craft. It is, well, it's crazy. <laughs> uh, we've got robot laser charge as well, which we don't need. Um, I think we should be fine with all this. Oh, geez, those diamonds. We definitely don't want those in there. Um, let's trade those out for this and put that in there. 
Oh, I need to- I definitely need to sort out these, but we don't have time because I need to go and fight Mobzilla. Now, where on earth should we go to fight him? I'm thinking one of these dimensions. Now, I can't remember which one we used. Uh, which one was it? Was it the rainbow dimension? I think it might have been. Might have been the rainbow dimension. Uh, let's get rid of that. There we go. Um, which one is it in? Is it this one? This is... what's in here? Why is there nothing in here? Hello? Oh, they are in there. Okay, yeah. Do we have uh, we have a rainbow ant, so let's just get out of here. We go! Let's go and defeat mob. Oh, jeez, it's so dark. It's so, so dark. Um, this is the village. Oh, jeez. Okay, um, we're in trouble. Um, oh, jeez. Guys, there's robots everywhere. I need to get inside a house and sleep my butt off. There we go. We shouldn't have any issues here, so... How do I get... I can't even remember how to get rid of this. Do I press this? No? No, that didn't... Oh, this might have worked. Okay, wait. So I do this, and then I can make the bed come out, and then I can sleep. There we go. Okay, we're good. <laughs> we're good. All right, so now we retract the bed and pick this bad boy up. There we go. Very nice. And we should still have it on our back. Very cool indeed. Okay, that is, that is sorted. Now... Let's see if, um, Mobzilla can be spawned. Are you okay over there? What is going on? What on earth is going on? You stay away from me as well, guys. There's three. Three creepers, but they should run away from me, right? Let's see if this happens. Get away. Get away. Oh, no! No! What? The Ocelot backpack did not work! I'm wearing an Ocelot backpack! It's supposed to scare them away. Okay, fine. Fine. That- that doesn't happen anymore. That- that's okay. Uh, what we need to do now- Oh, jeez, what a nice hat. What a nice hat you have! <laughs> Give me that. I need to wear that right now. It's the cake one. I really can't see. There we go. Cake hat. Beautiful. That actually kind of matches. So look at this thing over here. Got a massive, like, sand temple. So I guess we should, um, I, we should try this right now. So Mobzilla is in a big old purple egg. And we are going to go over to a little bit of flat land. Kind of over here. I think we might have spawned Mobzilla in over here at some point. Yeah, look, because... <laughs> Everything is destroyed. Right. Okay, here we go. I'm a little bit nervous right now. I'm going to throw this away. I'm going to eat myself some lucky steak. This is lucky steak indeed. It might be a little bit of a frame rate drop, but am I ready for this? I'm not quite sure if I'm ready for this. Um, well, I'm going to have to be, so let's, let's do this. In three, two, one, boom. Oh, yes, it worked. It worked this time. Okay, how do I take this guy down? Okay, um, yeah, <laughs> I died very, very quickly, <laughs> um, he killed me instantly, he, he killed me instantly, okay, that's, um, that's, I didn't expect that, I did not expect that at all, uh, what kind of nest is this, it's a normal ant nest, I'll take it anyway, uh, I need to find my way back to that guy, uh, where is it, it's, it's a little bit far away, so you know what, let's use our hoverboard, that was insane. Do we need to use a cephadrome up in here? I don't know if I've got a cephadrome on me. We might be able to go back and get one, but... Jeez! That guy absolutely owns me. Um, why are you... What's happening? What's happening? Please don't explode. Please don't explode on me. The only problem is, is I hope that my, um... What's it called? My, my hoverboard doesn't get destroyed when Mobzilla feels like being a pain in the butt and killing me. Now, let's see what happens when we get back to him, shall we? What happened to this tree? This tree is just chilling <laughs> inside this house. Okay, we should be close to him now. He should be just over the horizon. It will be a little bit choppy. Um, okay, he's a little bit further. I'm going to meet you guys there because, yeah, I, I, I'm kind of not looking forward to this. Oh, jeez, there's a giant red spider robot as well just literally roaming around the land. <laughs> I am going to leave that all by itself. <gasps> I've just spotted someone with the craziest hat. Look, he's got a little panda hat. I kind of want it. Come here. Come here. Can I reach you from here? There we go. Panda. Yes, I definitely want that. Let's go, Panda. Done. Did it work? Yeah, that is awesome. Okay, so I'm still not there. It's still a little bit further away. <laughs> I kind of need some help from those villager archers. I wonder if the ultimate bow works. I'm pretty sure it does not work on Mobzilla. I hope he hasn't despawned either. I probably should have grabbed a zookeeper shard. Um, I don't have one on me. So if he has despawned, I need to go back to the normal dimension. So where we live. And then, oh wait, is he here? Is he here or has he transported? Look, here's the ground that he's destroyed. This is where I died. Where is Mobzilla? Let's follow the path. Oh, jeez. 
Okay, he's definitely... Uh, there he is. Okay, there he is. How you doing, buddy? Let's see if this works. Oh, it does work. It does work. Okay, I can't see his health right now, but it does seem to work with the ultimate bow. He is absolutely wrecking this village. Okay, uh, oh, this guy's got sunglasses. Let me see if I can get him. Let me see if I can get him. Quick, get him. Get him. Get him. I want his hat. I want his hat. Please. There we go. I got the sunglasses. All right, let's try and kill this guy, shall we? I am a little bit worried that he's going to kill me, though. It's a little bit laggy because he's literally destroying everything. But I don't know if the ultimate bow is doing any damage. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I want to kind of get close enough to see the damage. It's doing nothing. Okay, let's just kill him. Let's just kill him. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Nice. Just get him. Just get him. Oh, this sword is doing so much. D d dam damage. Um, I think I've lost my hoverboard now as well. Okay. Uh, yeah, this is going to be a lot harder than I thought it was going to be. He keeps jumping in the air and destroying me. Am I going to need a cephadrome up in here? You know what? Hoverboards are cool and all, but I'm going to go home and grab myself a cephadrome and see if that works because this guy's powerful. He's um, he's he's very very powerful. Sepha, Sepha, Sepha drone, Sepha, 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 Sepha drone. Where on earth are you? Um, I don't know. I I don't think I used all the Sepha drones, did I? Um, no, I didn't. I've got six. Okay, I think I need raw beef for them as well. I've only got three raw beef, which is a bit of a problem because I keep killing cows with my ultimate sword, um, or I have been at least, and it's been killing them and making normal beef. So I actually need another rainbow ant spawn egg as well because I've just used my last one. Please let there be one. Please let me go rainbow and please be one. Please be one. Please be one. Ah! Yes, I got three. Perfect. Okay, let's grab those and let's go back and try and defeat this big punk also known as Mobzilla. This is going to be one of the hardest mobs so far just because he kills us in one hit, which is absolutely insane. It seems to only be when he does his um his jump attack, which I think is why the Cephadrome will be better. So let's see if this works, shall we? Where on earth is he going to be? He's going to be close. He's going to be really close. He's going to be over here. So let's get our Cephadrome ready first. Give him beef. There we go. We should be able to ride him now. There we go. Now, I can't remember which key is up. Oh, no, wait. Whoa, look all this damage. Oh, jeez. I am so sorry, villagers. I am so sorry. Look all this damage he's caused. Okay, uh, Mobzilla is an absolutely crazy, crazy giant. Now, where is he? He's got to be around here somewhere. Um... Just follow the destruction and you will find him. Is he around here? There he is. Okay, let's see if we can get him from here. There we go. There we go. This is working. I'm inside. <laughs> I'm inside Mobzilla. That works. This works. This works. This works. I'm not taking any damage either. Mobzilla, I am going to destroy you and your family. Well, hopefully you don't have any family because that would be absolutely awful. Now, the real test is when he jumps like that. I think it worked. Cephadromes for the win. Cephadromes are so awesome. They really, really are. Okay, we just uh, scoot around here, and there we go. Um, come on, come on, really? How am I supposed to do this? He keeps, he keeps hitting, killing me. He keeps on killing me. Why is there such a big flood here? What did Mobzilla do? Did he do anything or are you literally just completely flooded? Now, uh, it does look a little bit weird because I'm a wasp right now, which <laughs> I love this wasp model. I don't even know why. So, um, he is around here somewhere. Again, we're gonna have to follow the destruction and we need to find our Cephadrome from somewhere because... Uh, I don't really want to use another one just yet, just because I've only got two raw beef, which is a little bit worrying. Um, oh my goodness, where is he? Where on earth is he? Is he around here? I think this is where I died last time. Mobzilla! Mobzilla, where are you? Ah, there's my hoverboard. Perfect. Okay, so... Uh, I'm just gonna try and grab this real quick. There we go. Grab it. Grab it. Nice. Give me my hoverboard. Perfect. Now, where on earth is my Cephadrome? Because I really need it. I really, really need it. Now, I don't know how I'm supposed to do that. Maybe I just need to get away from him when he jumps because he keeps on making me hit the ground too hard, which, um, personally, I think is very, very unfair. Oh, where is my Cephadrome? Please don't say you killed him. Um, okay, there's Mobzilla. Hello, how are you doing? Where is my Cephadrome, buddy? Where is he? Where on earth is he? Um, oh, geez, no, stay away from me. I'm just a lonely little wasp. Just a lonely little wasp in a lonely little world. Let me just see how much health he has. Okay, he keeps the health that he has, so that is good. That is a good start, but... Oh, geez, how am I supposed to do this? 
I've lost my Cephadrome, so at least I know my Cephadrome dies. Um, can I get in from here? He's, he's getting hurt by something. I don't know what it is, though. I'm just gonna stay near his back and try and hit him from as far away as possible! No! Okay, I'm gonna try out the hoverboard method again. Now, apparently, you can't... Well, going from behind near his tail is an absolutely terrible idea, which is what I just did. So, we need to just keep drive buying him and... Oh, no, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh, jeez. So... Oh, jeez. This village has been absolutely decimated. Absolutely destroyed. So, we need to stay away from his tail and try and get him from the front. And that's kind of hard when you've got a lot of laggy things going on here. There we go. Let's get him. Let's get him. Let's get him. Get away from his tail, though. Get away from his tail, though. <laughs> Oh, Mobzilla. Oh, Mobzilla, you absolute punk. I'm gonna try one more Cephadrome. Now, I'm gonna take a little bit of a different tactic this time. Uh, I'm just gonna stay away from his back, <laughs> pretty much. Uh, I need to find him first, though. Where is he? Where is he? Follow the destruction. I think he might be this way, because um, this is where most of the red dots are, which means that's the most places that I've died. Um, where is he? These villagers are surviving pretty well. Better than I am. Um, where is he? Mobzilla! Mobzilla, where are you? Is he around this way? I have no idea where he is. I'm a little bit worried. I'm a little bit worried. I think he's made his way across this way. Mobzilla! Mobzilla! Now, apparently, you can make it so that, um, you, you can hit him with the ultimate bow, but it's just not very good. Like, at all. I think he's over this way. Um, for this fight, I'm gonna turn off shaders just because I want it to be as least laggy as possible. Now, stay back. Stay back. Try and get in with these now. Oh, no. Don't throw that. Don't throw that. What are you doing? Uh, okay. So, here we go. I've turned off the shaders. This should work perfectly. It's crazy laggy. I have... I have broken Godzilla. I can't even move right now. I can't even move. Just go up. Just go up. There we go. That's better. I just need to get as much damage on him as possible with the ultimate bow and then go in for the kill. But stay away from his tail because as you can see, he's flinging these villagers around like crazy. Oh my goodness, he is destroying this village like crazy. Look at him. He just, he just does not care, does he? He does not care one single bit. Oh my goodness. He's got such a weird hitbox as well. I don't know where the hitbox is, but it's not on his head. Definitely not on his head. Quick, go, Cephadrome. Go! Oh, it's underneath him. And I just killed a villager by accident. <laughs> okay, it's underneath. It's like his belly is his, um, his hitbox. Stay away from the tail! Stay away from the tail! Okay, I think I've got this. Is he healing, though? I don't know if he's healing. I have no idea. Whoa! Okay. Back up, buddy. Back up. There we go. There we go. I think he's healing a little bit, but this sword, if I keep doing this, I should be okay. I just need him to not stomp on me because that's where I'm dying. There we go. There we go. In. 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 Yeah, that was a good couple of shots right there. He's doing a spin attack right now. This guy is an absolute beast. He is one of, he's got to be the hardest boss we've taken on so far. He must be. Oh no, he's killing my Cephadrome. He's killing my Cephadrome. My Cephadrome only has 32 health left. That is, that is not good. I'm getting hurt by something. What is hurting me? What is hurting me? I have no idea what's going on. Cephadrome, are you okay? Are you okay? He's gaining health a little bit. Can I feed him beef? I kind of don't want to. I don't know why I'm getting hurt. It's being so laggy right now. The Cephadrome's hurting me. I must have hit him by accident. Okay, uh, that's not good. That is really not good. So, one more tactic I want to try is just going in as a wasp. Because I think I've got better maneuverability like this. Oh. Um. Um, really? Really? <laughs> oh, jeez. We, we've messed up, guys. we messed up big time. Oh, he's coming. Oh, jeez. Okay, I've just logged straight back in. And he is in and ready to destroy. So, at least I know where his hitbox is now. Let's just take him out like this. There we go. There we go. That was some decent damage. That was some decent damage. I just need to go in from the front and avoid all of those fireballs. There we go. Yeah, tactics. Tactics. I hope he's not regening too much because he is quite fast. I think that's because he's so big, though. Stay away from the tail. Stay away from the tail. There we go. There we go. Get him. Get him. Get him from the front. From the front. Yes. Um, is he not dying? Please die. Please die. Please get hit. What is going on? I am slaying his belly right now, and he's just not dying. There we go. 
What is happening? I have no idea what's happening. <laughs> this is the weirdest boss battle ever. I think we're, we're almost down to half his health though. Oh, I hit his tail. I hit his tail. Okay, so the wasp thing's gonna work. Give me a few minutes and I should be able to do this. Oh, look, there's a golem taking him on. <laughs> go, golem, go. Flip him. Flip him. That would be incredible if he flipped him. Can you imagine? He is destroying everything, guys. He is destroying absolutely everything. Whoa, okay. That was, that was a little bit close. A little bit close. There we go. There we go. That's not too bad. We just need to get multiple hits in at the same time. It's when he spins around, we have some big issues. Uh, I think I should be able to do this. Is he getting hurt by his own lightning as well? I'm not too sure. He's making big sounds too. Uh, can I kill him, please? Come on. Come on. Get him. Get him. Kill the Zilla. Kill the Zilla. Guys, my strategy so far is working. Look how low I've got his health down. So what I've been doing is kind of seeking out his hitbox with my ultimate bow. And then, oh geez, I had a good like 10 minutes a minute ago where I didn't die once, which was pretty cool. And then he just straight up killed me. So I'm just kind of activating his hitbox. Oh, this is close. Oh, this is really close. Okay, you want to see the state of the map after this as well. It is it's done so much Damage. Oh, I thought he despawned for a second. I would have raged so hard if he'd have despawned because this has been the hardest battle of Crazy Craft so far. Okay, he's really close. He's really close. Don't hit me with that tail. Do not hit me with that tail. And sometimes he's like really immune. So I kind of just fish it out with my um with my ultimate bow to see if the hitbox is working right now. See, look, it's not working. And there we go. It's straight in. So come on, we need to get a couple more good hits. Like four. Oh, come on. Four more hits. And I think he's good. I think he's good to die. Yes, that's another hit. That's another hit. There we go. Nice. How much health do you got left, buddy? How much health have you got left? You've got a tiny bit. Ooh, one more shot. One more shot and you are dead, buddy. You are out of here. Here we go. Here we go. Ah, oh, just one more shot. One more shot and you're dead. Come on. Really? 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 Now, this sounds weird, but I kind of need him to stay away from fire because I don't want his drops to fall in. That would be absolutely terrible. There we go. Whoa, we did it. We absolutely just did it. Okay, he drops a lot of stuff. My... Goodness, so let's get rid of the stuff we don't need. Oh, we did it. So I think these are what we need. These Mobzilla scales. Are these Mobzilla scales? Let me see. There we go. These are, yes, Mobzilla scales. So he doesn't drop the stuff um, straight away like some of the other bosses do. He drops the Mobzilla scales, which we just need to use to craft the stuff that we need. Now, is this all like ultimate armor and stuff? He drops a lot of beef. A lot of beef. Oh, what's this? Wait a second. Wait a second. Amethyst. Okay, that's not what we need. What we need is... Uh, we can make a Mobzilla book. There we go. Mobzilla scale. So we need one, two, three, four, five. Um, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four. Twenty-four. We should be good. We should be good. There are two different helmets for some reason. So we should be good for that amount of scales. I just want to see if we're missing anything. Uh, the axe... Yeah, I'll take the axe. I mean, why not? Let's take one of those. Um, wow. The, the amount of damage this has done is absolutely insane. We've also got a shovel. We kind of have a shovel. Let's just grab as many Mobzilla things as we can. There's tons around here. So many. Um, any more? Any more scales? Let's see if there's any more around here. Oh, is this a dried Mobzilla egg as well? I think it actually is. Oh, dried dragon spawn egg. Um, I think I might take that. Yeah, I'm gonna take that. I don't think the amethyst is worth taking. I'm pretty sure. Look at all this destruction. Oh, I feel so bad for the villagers that live here. He dropped fire as well. I might actually take that because that's a very, very unique item indeed. Oh, I don't need this coal. Look, just straight up fire. That is awesome. Um, what else do we need? Oh, some raw beef. Yeah, I'm gonna take that as well. Oh, is this Mobzilla meat? I don't even know. I think it's raw beef. I'm going to take this so that we, just in case we need any more cephadromes. There's some more scales here as well. Oh, today is a good day. Today is a good, good day. Right then, let me transform into my normal self. And let's quickly look at the map. Look, we spawn, <laughs> we spawn Mobzilla down here. And he trounced all the way around here. All the way up to this point where we slayed him. 
slayed him. What I was a bit worried about was that we wouldn't have enough to be able to... Where's my ants? Okay, my ants are here. Um, I, I was a bit worried we wouldn't be able to get enough of his drops for some reason, but I think we're pretty good. We don't need this ant nest right now. We just need one of these and get out of here. There we go. Something tried to bite me, but I do not care one bit. Look, this is where we started our adventure. Right here. Right. Let's get back and craft this Mobzilla armor. Yeah! Here we go. So we should be able to put some of these eggs back in that we don't actually need. Just so I know where they are. So that, 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 and Mobzilla can go back in there. That can't go back in there. But we have got so many Mobzilla scales. It is un. Real. We've got a stack in a bit, so we might even be able to gift the other guys something because they've done a lot for us. They have pranked us a lot, but they've done a lot for us. So if they haven't got the Mobzilla armor right now, I might be able to give them a set to each. But let's see how much we've got. Let's make this. There we go. And this was the ultimate goal because apparently this is the best armor. Look at this. Oh, jeez. What are we wearing? We're not, we haven't even got any enchantments on this one. Oh, dude. This is sick. This is so good. Yes. Oh! <laughs> I need to make another mannequin so that I can give my armor to it and then have it on the other side. Dude, this is so cool. This is so, so cool. Do I have enough space for this? Let me grab a mantis claw and a mantis claw from here. I just want to put it in a row just so I know where it is. So we've got that, 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 and that. Guys, guys, we did it. We actually did it. And we've got fire. This is straight fire. It's so lit, guys. It's so... Oh, jeez! Look at my face. That actually looks kind of menacing. It looks like I've got eyes at the top of me. Let me just quickly take my hat off for a second. Uh, how do I take it off? There we go. Look at us. We now have ourselves so much good armor is unreal. And if we do need to kill another Mobzilla, we might be okay to do it in this armor. Anyway, guys, that's pretty much going to end out today's episode. Thank you so much for sticking with me. Sorry I was kind of all over the place, but we killed... Mobzilla and got ourselves this crazy crazy cool armor so if you did enjoy please give a big fat thumbs up that'd be greatly appreciated and if this happens to be the first video seen by me please do consider subscribing to join team TDM today for daily gameplay videos apart from that thank you guys so much for watching i'll see you in the next video again yeah. press start